Hello, and I would like to welcome you to the Laramie K Optician Works Training Center, where today I am going to give you five tips for the beginner the person who is just starting to edge lenses. Now, I think a very conservative figure for myself probably edged over 10,000 pairs of glasses in my time as a working optician. Boy, have I learned some things, and boy, have I made some mistakes. Every once in a while, I'm going to toss out these little five tip nuggets and hopefully help you avoid some of the things that I learned the hard way. These five tips that I'm about to give you really boil down to a pretty simple idea. And that is that the life of a working optician is full of distractions. Every time you turn around, you're pulled away from that job, pulled away from the edger to do something else. Every time you walk away from that job, that tray, that job, that work is left vulnerable to problems. Somebody else comes along, moves it, dumps it, trips over, falls, ends up on the floor, picks it up. You have no idea what takes place when you're at lunch, right? If you follow these simple guidelines and others as we fill in through this series, you will find that you are much more likely to catch an error before you go running that lens and creating garbage and problems and waste. So let's take a look. Tip number one is always, always, always use a tray. A tray keeps your work together, your work organized. As I just mentioned, your biggest threat to doing great finishing work is distractions. When you come back and everything's still in one place in a tray, you're much less likely to have a problem. Once you pick it up, move it around, set it somewhere else, and everything stays together. This particular tray is for Mr. Trey, whose first name is Trey, which would make this Tray, trays, tray. Tip number two is probably the single most important tip of all. And it's going to be a little tough for some of you, but boy, you had better work on it. Tip number two is be neat. Everything in its place. Every tray should look almost identical to every other tray. A work order, right lens for the job on the right, left lens for the job on the left, set of blocks, leap pads, AR pads if you needed them, frame, laid out nice and neat in a tray, always looking the same way. Be neat. Tip number three is always mark your lenses. Always mark your lenses. Nice big R, I'm using a grease pencil, you can use this or an AR pen. Nice big R for the right. And a nice big L there on the left. That way if somebody comes along during your break or at lunch or when you're distracted, drops the tray, picks things back up, you can figure out if they got mixed up or not and not have an error. Number four is kind of a pet peeve of mine. And I think again, kind of like being neat is maybe perhaps the single most important thing to doing good finishing work. And that is being consistent. For instance, blocks. I always load my blocks the same way, notch up, face up. I'm right-handed, so I take my AR leap, sorry, my leap pad tab to the right, keeping my fingers off the part that's actually going to adhere to the block. Smooth that out. Notch up, face up. I'm right-handed, so I peel from the right, adhere it. You will be absolutely amazed at the number of times you catch a mistake before you run a lens and create an error if you just do things in a consistent manner every single time. Mm -hmm. 
Tip number five is always, always, always work your right lens first. What does that mean? No matter what part of the process you're working through, let's say you're blocking, you're always going to grab your right lens first, block your right, and always your left second. Right lens first, left lens second. That's how your edger is going to be set up. That's how your tray should be set up. And that is how you should always work your job, obviously assuming that you have a right and a left lens to do. I do hope you found that helpful. If you did, by all means, please hit the like button and please feel free to leave me any questions down there in the comments section. Thanks. I'll see you next week. Thank you.